Uh, when I got out of the Navy in 2010, uh, I went home, I was bored, so I looked for something to do. And uh, one of my friends from high school, she was really into kickball, so it just sounded like fun. So I, I followed her to one of the games, and it was like nothing you could expect. I mean, there were like 45 teams, everybody dazzled in uniforms, and they were like really athletic playing kickball. So yeah. um, I played for a few years in Maryland, and then uh, I moved to Virginia Beach. And I played down there, and I liked it so much. When I moved out here, I looked around on the internet, couldn't find it. I said, well, I, I'm just going to start one, so that's what I did. We officially um, started playing in August, I mean, excuse me, October of uh, last year. Um, I, so I started, when we got here in February, so I started making phone calls and um, trying to rent fields and things like that, get, you know, get, every, get everything tied up. And so we, I went through that whole process over the summer, promoted, passed out flyers in, in the Lemoore area, and it took off, and here we are. So, I mean, there, there were mixed reviews. I, I don't want to embellish too much. There was a lot of, you know, you take uh, something that, like adult kickball to adults, and most of them kind of laugh at you. Mm -hmm. And then other people look at you like, okay, it sounds fun, but are you serious? And so that was kind of a review, and then the other review was like, holy crap, where do I sign up? So that, those are three kind of reviews I got, and once they showed up to the field and they saw what it was, the field was painted, their balls, their rules, everything, um, it just kind of started, people, a friend tell a friend, another friend tell another friend, and then the word got out. This area is like a, a treasure trove of soccer players, so I mean, I've never seen the ball kick so hard so far in my life, and I've been doing it six years. Like some of these guys in this Central Valley area, they really steam these balls. I mean, um, you have other players who are really into baseball and softball, and essentially the layout of kickball is, is softball. So mm -hmm. it's like slow-pitch softball with a 10-person 10, 10 defense. So for the people who grew up around this area who've been playing that, they jump right in it. They understand it. I don't have to tell them anything. They jump right in. So yeah. you have those kind of people. It's a good way to, you know, break the monotony. You, you know, we get older and nobody, we, we all tell our parents, I can't wait to get out of the house. I'm going to do X, Y, Z. And then most of us just kind of sit down and grab a beer in a favorite show. And that's the routine. You go to work, you get up, you shower, you do it all over again. It's like, it's nice to get out. It's nice to meet people. It's nice to run around. You know, I'm, I'm 32 and, you know, I have players who are younger than me who, get tired fast, it's like, how are you so tired? You get out, you have to, let's use it, you yeah. use it before you lose it, you know? So it's a good way to get out and, and stay active, you know, and make new friends. Like I'm not from here and now I have a whole network of friends that I would have never had had I not done this. So.